Welcome back guys to the Battle for Remore. I'm David. I'm Ross. And we're containing a little bit of our narrative today for the Battle for Remore campaign. We just finished off Meat Grinder. We're now cracking on over to the finale, the yeah. pinnacle of this campaign. Um, so what's happened guys? So in Meat Grinder, uh, Belson and Talazar managed to get a victory over the Tau. Um, albeit it was the initial bombardment in that battle that really softened up the Tau and took out their leadership. Yeah, Onvalkan and Korovelk just could not survive that. On like The bombardment was horrendous. The Craftfold ships just rained from above, down below. It was quite glorious to watch. <laughs> Wasn't glorious to be on the receiving. No, no. But uh, was something else for that game. So... Story-wise, Talazar and Belson have regrouped their forces. They have managed to not just kick the Tau off the planet, they've slaughtered the Tau to yep. a man. So really, with the Tau incursions, and we did say at the start of the campaign, Tau had already gone out on what was essentially an extermination of the populace of the planet before they arrived. Before, sorry, the Elder arrived. Yep. Um, so all that's left really on this world now is the Elder themselves. Now the Elder's ambition in game was obviously stop whatever lies beneath from rising up and causing havoc in the eastern fringes. However, Farseer Talzar and Otart Belson have vastly, vastly misjudged the situation. So, some of you might guess what happens when, you know, when a planet is exterminated, you know, almost to a man, and then another force comes in and comes in and exterminates another force to a man, that this may bring on the ire of uh, the Chaos Gods, and one in particular has seen fit to uh, join in on the battle as such. And with that, the Chaos Demon Incursion of Corn will commence. So yeah, we have uh, one last battle to do here, really for Vermore. Can the Elder hold on as Corn brings on uh, basically their bloody onslaught? So a couple of wee quick pointers for you guys, just to prepare yourself from the battle that you'll hopefully be watching pretty soon. Um, going into this next battle, we're automatically going to give first turn to the corn. Yep. Um, there's a reason for that, which you'll find out in the introduction, obviously, to that battle as to why we're giving them automatic first turn. But Talazar and Belson are amassing whatever remaining forces they have to try and hold back what looks like a ferocious, ferocious horde of corn demons. So yeah, it looks to be a very exciting battle report, uh, one of the biggest ones we've done in quite a wee while, uh, bringing on a huge amount of forces. So guys, tune in next time for the finale of the Battle for Remore.